Title, Royals Score Cut. On Jackie Bradley Jr.'s Kansas City story, but what's next? TL, DR, former Red Sox hero Jackie Bradley Jr. found himself unattached as the Royals let him go, leaving us wondering about the next episode in his thrilling career saga. After an underwhelming .133 batting average season, it appears his $900,000 deal with the Royals was a box office bomb. However, with a solid history under his belt, including a stellar 2016, a gold glove, and a World Series victory in 2018, is this really the final act for our baseball star? Hark! Hear ye, hear ye. We've got a high-octane baseball drama unfolding right before our very eyes. Jackie Bradley Jr., a figure you might know from such classics as Boston Red Sox, World Series Champions 2018, got hit with the director's cut command from the Royals. That's right folks, the $900,000, one-year contract he had with Kansas City hit the cutting room floor after a less than stellar .133 batting average in 43 games. Now that's a plot twist if I've ever seen one. But hey, let's not forget that every hero has a backstory. Bradley was an all-star in 2016 and had the honor of being the MVP of the American League Championship Series for the Red Sox when they won the World Series in 2018. Not too shabby, huh? It seems like only yesterday when our hero was at the height of his career, batting home runs and capturing the hearts of baseball lovers everywhere. After Bradley left Boston as a free agent, he signed up for a season in Milwaukee, which turned out to be an interesting sequel but a bit of a box office letdown. He returned to Boston, then got traded to the Blue Jays, and finally found himself with the Royals. So, you see, our hero's career reads more like a globe-trotting adventure movie than a baseball player's journey. So, what's the next chapter in Bradley's journey? Are we looking at a Rocky-like comeback, or is this the end credits roll? The Royals now have seven days to trade Bradley or place him on waivers. The suspense, folks, is killing us. Now, while we're at it, Let's give a shout out to Darren Blanco from Triple Omaha, who started against the Reds in left field, batting ninth. This could be the start of a new lead actor in the making. Who knows? Speaking of twists and turns, let's spare a thought for Jacob de Grom, who is staring at a recovery time of at least 12 to 14 months post-surgery. Get well soon, champ. Now, remember, the world of baseball, just like Hollywood, is filled with ups, downs, hits, and misses. But hey, that's what keeps us on our toes, right? So, to wrap it up, what does the future hold for Jackie Bradley Jr.? A major comeback? A surprising plot twist? Only time will tell. Remember, in baseball as in life, it ain't over till it's over. So, will Jackie Bradley Jr. write his own Hollywood ending, or is this just another bump in the road to glory? What do you think, folks?